Hello, race fans. It's your favorite announcer, Mark Moreland, a.k.a. Emo, here with a rundown of another action-packed weekend with the blood, sweat, and tears racing. We are up in Phillips County and Lincoln County this weekend. Friday night at Phillips County, Saturday night at Lincoln County. It's part of our BST PCR LCR challenge. And to start out the night at Holyoke, we had our late models. It was the first round of the Nutrient Ag Solution Dirt car late model series and our winner there was Don Geis. Don Geis got out front and just ran away with the show, took the trophy home. So the Nutrient Ag Solution number 10, Don Geis, took home the late model show. Then we had our IMC stock cars and our first place winner in the stock cars was Kyle Clough, the flying farmer. He gets it done one more time. He's always fast, knows how to win. Them Clough brothers are so much fun and they're great to have come down to Holyoke. You know, Nebraska shows up, you know, like I say. Second was Angel Munoz. Angel Munoz was all over Kyle's bumper for most of the race, but he just couldn't quite get it done. He just couldn't get around him, you know what I'm saying? So then we had our sport mods. Troy Bain was leading a bunch of that race, and then he had to fall out. We had a yellow flag, put some of the drivers to the rear, and then we had our winner, Hunter Smith. Hunter Smith comes through the field and finishes first and takes a trophy home at Phillips County. Then we had our modifieds, IMCA style. Greg Gustus won that one. Then we had our hobbies, our hobby stocks and that was Zach Olmstead. Now Zach had a big lead on the field for quite a while until a yellow came out and then we had Trent Madsen came up and was just all over Zach's rear end but he just couldn't get around him and Zach won that hobby stock main event. Then next is our sport compacts. Our sport compacts was won by young Brock Liebhardt. Brock Liebhardt's come a long way. He's just turned into a great racer and he took care of business on Friday night. And then we had our Warriors. Now our Warriors are always exciting. We had the Gang Green, and Gang Green has dominated. They've dominated Friday night. J.D. Renfro took the win. Joe Renfro came in second. Now, I think he only needed a couple more laps. He kept gaining and gaining. I thought he was going to get his older brother, but Joe wound up second. And then Brianna Worthington took third. So then Saturday night, we all load up, and everybody goes up the North Platte, up there, Lincoln County, and had another great night of racing. Lincoln County comes, and they show up, and we had great concessionaires and had a live band. It's a big party atmosphere up there in Lincoln County. If you haven't been to one of those North Platte race nights, you really need to get up there and see what's going on because it's a good time. I'm telling you, good times with good people. And there we go. So anyway, late model, I call it redemption night because the late model main event was won by Joe Bellum. So Joe Bellum defeated the field there at Lincoln County and got it done. Don Geist came in second. So the first night it was Geist and Bellum and, uh, the second night, it was Bellum and then Geist. So Joe gets a little redemption on Saturday. So Saturday night, the IMCA modified main event was won by a racer named Dave Peterson from Nebraska. And then also our IMCA stocks was won by Joseph Cooper. So Joseph in the sport mod and the stock car this year, getting it done. The number 11 stock car just took him to the, the woodshed, as I like to say. He just got it done. He's a great young racer. And we had our hobby stocks, Tyler Thompson from Nebraska. Tyler Thompson won that race. And then our sport compacts, we had a great racer named Riley Flores. Riley took first place and Brock Liebhart took second. So there you go. Brock on the podium both nights. Joe Bellum and Don Geist on the podium both nights. And Troy Bain, he redeemed himself in the sport mod main event. Troy Bain won that one. After falling out on Friday night, he comes back on Saturday night and he gets his redemption. So you never Never know what's going to happen in race and that's why you got to be there be there for the excitement then our warriors is once again gang green gang green once again gets her done the winner then saturday though was jonas aragon so jonas aragon got her done older brother big brother jd jd renfro comes in second and then brianna she finishes third again so she's on the podium two nights jd's up there two nights and jonas aragon collects the trophy so there you go that's our wrap up of the bst racing on on last weekend, the 31st of May and the 1st of June, the BST PCR LCR Challenge, and that's just what happened. So everybody, glad you tuned in. If you haven't subscribed yet, you need to maybe give a little poke and subscribe to BST Racing YouTube channel, and I'll see you in Victory Circle.